Industrial engineering students at NJIT have a new tool for learning, a streamlined version of an automated assembly line. The facility incorporates systems found in factories and food processing plants and even blood testing labs. Science and technology correspondent Patrick Regan reports. Hardware and software components for the new Vincent Stabile Laboratory, delivered late last year, have now been installed, debugged, and brought online for undergraduate and graduate courses. The lab integrates a variety of robots and sensors with the same kinds of network control and logic control that the university's graduates are likely to encounter on the job, along with some of the same real-world challenges. Springs. Springs are a real problem in assembly lines because they're flexible, they want to jump all over the place. The objects being assembled here are what Professor Sancho Das calls dummy parts with no real function, but they have characteristics that correspond to real products. The line itself is a somewhat simpler and much smaller version of systems made by the German company Festo, designed to support many different kinds of student projects. We want to promote um, concepts of automation, innovation, and mostly to reduce costs and improve efficiency. As you know, everybody wants to, to reduce costs. We want to make things at a much faster rate, more efficient rate. So we have classes in systems analysis, uh, robotics, uh, industrial control, uh, simulation. Normally we are only able to teach the individual pieces of equipment and the individual pieces of technology. Uh, but when they go out of industry, they see all of them simultaneously and they get overwhelmed. Now we're able to do it in the classroom all together at, one, at the same time. Patrick Regan, NJN News, Newark.